Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, I'm coming at you with a ritual artifact deck. Um, I really got into liking rituals since uh, Sapphira came out. Um, I'm still making my Yangzing, but it's still a work in progress. I'm still trying to get the rest of the rest of my stuff for it. So I'm sorry about the wait, you guys, but I'm trying to complete it as fast as I can. But um, yeah, for now, here's my. Ritual Artifact deck. So, Artifact, uh, Chalk Ram. It's basically a really good card. Um, basically the artifacts have an effect where you can set it and the spell and trap, and then, um, if it's destroyed, then you can supposed to stone it, but this effect also allows you, or its secondary effect is basically if a spell or trap would be destroyed, you can return it to your hand and then supposed to stone this guy out, so it's really quite a uh, good card overall. And then Artifact Lancia. Um, basically, you can banish it, and then it prevents uh, uh, monsters from being banished. So um, for that one turn, so it's basically pretty good. And then get or. Er, Guy at or Guy Utino Magami. Uh, sorry if I blur a that name, but um, you basically use this for honest targets or um, not honest. My bad. Uh, Herald of Perfection. <laughs> my bad. Brain fart. Um, and then one uh, Mystic uh, Shine Ball. You're supposed to be run three of this. I want to use how the one for now, so yeah. And then Songbird, I got two. And then I got one Manju. Um, I know you're supposed to be around three, three of this, two of the Songbird, and then three, two or three of the Senju. So, um, but I'm running like a different type of build than that. And then Honest, um. Most of everything, most everything is light in in this uh, deck, so it's pretty easy. Uh, honest targets, and then gores just for dropping it uh, on where light light swarm people uh, attack. So it's pretty fun. And then I'm running the agents, in, or at least a couple agents in here. Earth and Saturn. I the I like I really like Saturn. It's a really excellent card um, overall. So, and then I'm running a Art Lord Chrysia in here because most most of everything is fairy, so I should or it's pretty easy to get this card out as well. So yeah, and then I'm running Scrap Beast and Summoner Monk. Um, just for an easy uh, uh, low eight or uh, rank four, but I'm usually going to go for a uh, low eight. So, and then for my rituals, um, I'm basically playing Sapphira and uh, Herald of Perfection, the, the Ghost Fairy that I pulled, and my um, Gold Series uh, Haunted Mine. So, and then Magician of Black Chaos. Gotta love the old classic card from the premium collection. And then I'm basically run three uh, Relinquish. Gotta, gotta run the old classic card of him as well. So, you know. And that's basically it for the monsters. And now for spells and traps. There, for the traps, there's only one, but. I'll show you that when I get there. But first, suppose three spell book of wisdom, most annoying card, spell card of all time. It's like oh, mirror force chain spell book of wisdom, unaffected by traps. Like wow. Okay, so that's what, that's what I'm basically running it because I got running Christian here, and I got um dark Ma or uh, uh crap. What is his name? Which is in Black Chaos. <laughs> I, I swear I, I cannot remember names today. 
of uh, cards. Anyway, so uh, that's why I basically run three. Um, three MST. Oh, whoops. My bad. Only two. <laughs> um, just to get rid of exposure traps. Just stuff like that. And then two Dark Factory of Mass Production. We're getting back to normal monsters from the graveyard, so for more targets for Herald of Perfection, so you know. And then the Sanctuary in the Sky. So Saturn's effect can go off. Basically, why I play it. And then two Hyam of Light. One is for the Ritual Summon, and one is for the other effect, so. My ritual monster, my ritual monsters cannot be destroyed by battle or by card effect. So that's basically why I play um, summoner monk, summoner monk, and then Dawn of Herald, uh, black magic uh, ritual, and then black illusion ritual. Uh, pretty good old classic cards. And then for my one trap, Royal Decree, because uh, Royal Decree is it is kind of hard to get over, and so is Mirror Force. So that's basically why you play it. I know they ain't MST it, but you know you never know. Um, so for extra deck, Star Dragon is the Premium Gold. Uh, Leo, is I can make it, and then start your kind of hard to get off. But I can still make it. And then for XC's number 101, um, Volcasaurus, and Strike Bounder. So, um, yeah, that's basically my uh, art or ritual artifact deck that uh, I have for you guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, my deck that I was uh, uh, playing was a Yangzine ritual deck, which that just really sucked so that's why I just made an artifact ritual deck or ritual artifact deck which will probably work a lot more better so um yeah so thank y'all for watching uh don't forget to like comment and uh, subscribe and uh like I said I will try to get you guys the Yang Zing deck as fast as possible but I can't guarantee any promises so yeah and then if you guys haven't checked out my mu uh, my music playlist uh go ahead and do so because there's Login music that's on there, so yeah. I will catch you guys there. Alright, there you guys.